Tenths of an acre, I'm sure you know that. And set the sunroom. The garage up the back. This house has been impeccably cared for. There's some random lady walking around. here. Into the kitchen. The kitchen has updated countertops and cupboards, at least not the original. Decent appliances. Nice still actually. This room minus the panel is a neat little room. Shape. And then we've got this three seasons room. We'll see if I can open. This is your three seasons. Very nice. here and there other than that cosmetically not a lot you have to do right away this is your big master at 23 by 12 just a decorative fireplace and also additional storage.
windows has pretty expensive wood shutters on them. This is the smallest upstairs bedroom, or second smallest altogether. And 14 by 11, still bigger than average. And then again with two big closets. And your main bath for the upstairs. We'll go down the basement. And the basement. I think I like, might like this house the most. Unique characteristics down here. This is like 700 plus square foot. This big area. Again, everything is in really great condition. So, back here behind the bar, can be pretty much anything. This must have been the old laundry. I forgot to show you the half bath and laundry upstairs. Here's your furnace room. Furnace was just put in over the weekend. High efficiency. Uh, water tank's in good shape. Looks like they have, they're on public water and sewer, but they do have. I believe, and I need to confirm this, but it looks like they still have a well that is probably active just for the sprinklers, which there's a sprinkler system built in. There's some well equipment. There's your water shut off. And big area here for storage or whatever you might your workshop area. A little more under the steps. The box is only 100 amp, but they do have this extra that Looks like it's mostly for some of the stuff outside, fountain, etc. And what's that other bathroom? Oh, we keep it over here. Through here is another entrance. There's two front entrances, one well, breezeway entrance is this one. Half bath and first floor laundry. The garage comes off the back of the house. It's quite large, definitely a two car plus. Doors are really quality, heavy doors. 